Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Fitness for Transformation. My name is Juan, and today I will be guiding you through a new high intensity arms workout. Today's training is composed of a warm up, a three round circuit training, and a cool down. Today's practice does not include a full body stretch. If you have not stretched, take a look at the link in the description below for my latest full body stretch routine. Get that done and come back and join us for today's practice. Let's take a look at the exercises that we're going to be performing in today's circuit training. Wide push-ups. Forearm plank with taps. Hand walk back and forth. Jumping jacks variation. Plank toe taps. Shoulder taps. And pushbacks. Alright guys, let's go ahead and begin with our warm-up. First up, we have Ys. Bend your knees, hips and torso come beyond a 45 degree angle. Arms are extended in front of you. We're going to bring them up to a Y shape before bringing them back down and repeat. Keep your neck and spine neutral. This is just a warm up round. Take these at your own pace. We have about five seconds left of this exercise. And we're moving forward with arm circles, forward and backwards. In two, one, stand up straight, arm circles forward, arm circles backwards. Nice inhale as they come up. Exhale as they come down. Last couple seconds here. And we're returning to our 45 degree angle bend and moving on, moving forward to T arm raises. Here we go. Come down to that 45, arms extend out to your side. Feel free to come in at more than a 45 degree angle. Find what works for you. Last couple of seconds here before we move forward to the punch combination, which is going to be jab and straight. Here we go. Find your fighter stance. Jab, straight, jab, straight, and repeat. Nice, strong, coordinated movement. Strong stance. Focusing on our breathing and engaging our core. Last couple of seconds here before we move forward to W arm raises. Here we go. Come back to that 45 degree bend. This time arms come out to your sides and they extend out. Here we 
go. Jumping jacks. Nice traditional jumping jack. Landing nice and light. Last 10 seconds here. Great job, guys. Go ahead and take a 30 second rest, and we'll be here for round two. Starting with Y's. Come back to that 45 degree angle. And arms are right in front of us. Here we go. Come straight up into that Y. Bring it back down. And repeat. Take your time with this. seconds left on the clock before we move forward to arm circles forward and backwards in three two one here we go stand up straight arm circles forward arm circles backwards nice big circles here we have about 10 seconds left before we move forward to our arm raises, which this time is a T. Here we go. Come back to that 45 degree. Arms come out to your sides. T shape. Warm 
Make sure you finish strong. And we'll be ready to start the first round of our circuit. Three, two, one. Great job, guys. Come ahead and take a 30 second rest, and we'll be here for round one of our circuit training. Shoulder with your hand. Keep 
Your core engaged, booty engaged. And focus on your breathing. Try not to sway left and right. Last couple of seconds. And we're moving over to shoulder taps. Excuse me, pushbacks. Hands come out wide, feet come out wider, the hips width, and we're coming down and dropping before we push back and return to that high push up position. Drop and push back. You're just dropping about a mid push up position and then coming back into that push back. Keep your joints stacked. Let's keep nice and wide. Last couple seconds here. Here we go, guys. Finish strong. Great job. Go ahead and take a 60 second rest. And we'll be here for round two of our circuit training. Let's go ahead and get started with a round two of our circuit. Let's bring it down to the ground. Get ready for those wide push-ups again. Here we go. Starting in three, two, one. Dropping down to that wide push-up. Nice strong up. Inhale as you come down. Exhale as you come up. Find that strength in that breath. Jack, 
variation. Arms up and straight in front of you. After this, we move forward to a plank toe tap. Round two, guys, you guys got this. We're halfway through this. Last couple seconds. Here we go. Down to the ground, plank toe taps. Stack those joints, back plank. Here we go. Hands to opposite foot. Return to starting position, repeat with the other side. Stack your joints. Extend your back. Focus on your breath. Last couple seconds. And move forward to our shoulder taps. Nice wide stance. Hands come to diamond. Strong high plank, core is engaged, joints are stacking, wrists are directed below our shoulders. Last couple seconds here guys, before we move forward. With pushbacks. Here we go. Widen out that handstand. Come down and push back. Return to your starting position and repeat. Inhale as you drop. Exhale as you push back. This way. Last couple seconds, guys. Drop and push back. You got this. Finish strong. Drop. Push back. Great job, guys. Go ahead and take another 60 second rest. We'll be here for our final circuit. Plank with taps. 
Find that stance, widen out your feet. Find that balance and begin. Arm extensions, keep that core engaged. Keep that booty low. And always focus on finding that strength and that breath. Last couple seconds here. Move forward to our hand walk. Come up to your hands. Walk them back to your feet. And back out to your high plank. Strong core. We don't hyperextend our backs. The joints are stacked. The neck is neutral. Keeping that heart rate up. Last couple seconds here. We're going to move forward to our jumping jack variation. Here we go. Finish off that last walk and get right into it. Jumping jacks. We're halfway through round three. Strong in control here. We're determined to finish strong. We're motivated. Last couple of seconds before we take it back down. Some plank toe taps. Here we go, bring it down. High plank, wide stance at the feet, hand comes to opposite foot. Inhale as you come in, head as you come out. Into the nose. Forward to our shoulder taps. Hands come to diamond. Feet stay wide. Core stays engaged.
Great job, guys. Let's go ahead and get started with today's pull down. First up, we have a tricep stretch. Go ahead and bring those arms up. Grab that left elbow and bring it in, hug it in. Pull it in towards the opposite shoulder. Focus on finding your breath. Bring your heart rate down slowly. Find a nice deep stretch here. We're switching arms. In two, one, switch sides. Grab that right elbow, pull it towards the left shoulder. Give your arms just a little bit of room by slightly leaning your, leg, your neck and your head forward. Bicep stretch. Go ahead and send those arms back. Thumbs pointing down. Slightly lean your head forward again. And just pull those arms back. Next up, we're gonna do some arm swings. Go ahead and rest your arms right by your side. Bring your arms up one at a time. Go ahead and bring them back down to center. And just kind of give them a feel. Give them a shake, see what feels good. Find what works for you in this arm swing. And we're moving forward to a stretch. Grab your arm behind, underneath your elbow. Right arm comes underneath your left elbow. And hug it in. Keeping your gaze neutral. Keeping your shoulder down. Here we go. Next one, we're into a lateral stretch on our left hand side. Release those arms. Go ahead and grab each elbow above your head and lean over to the right. I might have said left, but we went right. And that's okay. We'll get to the other side next. Up to the other side. Here we go. Now we go left. Nice relaxing side stretch here. You should definitely feel this on your sides. Next up, we're going to a forward fold. Stay leaning left. And forward fold, extend those arms. One out in front of you, one behind you. Keep your neck neutral. And come to a halfway fold here, increasing into a forward fold. And so you can bring those hands to your foot and lean in. Last couple seconds, and we're doing the other side. Bring it right back up, half fold towards the right, left arm in front, right arm behind, and slowly creep into that forward fold. Nice and slow, getting your hamstring natural stretch. 
stretch there. Great job, guys. That concludes today's training. This has been Fitness for Transformation. My name is Juan. It's a pleasure training with you guys. I post instructional fitness routines every Monday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. And I look forward to seeing you next week. If you learned something new, make sure you give this a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching.